This is actually for ongoing training. When we hire the practitioners and they come into AHS or they come into a, um, a flight group in the contract delivery folks, they still need to upkeep their, their skills. And so they're already trained when they come in. What we're doing is uh, providing them with simulations that are evidence-based and are identified as good simulations to be delivering to the practitioners to keep their competency up. We can run adult male simulations, so that can be an adult stroke, somebody suffering from a, from a cerebral stroke, uh, acute coronary syndromes, amputations, really anything that clinically can happen, we can run in, in the mobile medical flight simulation trailer. But it's not just about adult males, it's, we also have an obstetric uh, female patient simulator, so we can do various types of deliveries, both high acuity deliveries and low acu uh, acuity deliveries. Uh, and then we also have a child patient simulator as well as an infant patient simulator. So really, because the practitioners are dealing with all age groups, all different types of uh, case scenarios, we need to provide them with that opportunity. Yeah, I think the challenge was actually providing that realistic environment for them to train in. So they could actually feel like they're inside an airplane that's moving, that's experiencing turbulence, takeoff and landing, and so that they can understand uh, what the impact has on the care that they provide and on the patient. Our air ambulances fly to all communities in Alberta, so it's important to be able to train not only the staff that are on the air ambulance, but also um, ground EMS crews in loading and offloading patients out of an airplane, which is different than in and out of an ambulance. So, it's, so this gives us the ability to train them how to do that safely and appropriately. And we'll also use this to train with the neonatal intensive care transport teams, the pediatric transport teams, so they'll all be exposed to that environment. Um, and they can train together as a team in a, real, a realistic setting in an aircraft.